If you've ever listened to popular music, you know why the psalmist says that he has put a new song in our heart. Because let's be honest, the world needs a new song. I wanna start with a, today with a, a secular song by John Mayer called In the Blood. Now, I want you to listen as he wrestles with his heart and how it keeps him tied to the bad, to the sin, to the evil in his life. Here's what he wrote. How much of my mother has my mother left in me? How much of my love will be insane to some degree? And what about this feeling that I'm never good enough? Will it wash out in the water or is it always in the blood? How much of my father am I destined to become? Will I dim the lights inside me just to satisfy someone? Will I let this woman kill me or do away with jealous love? Will it wash out in the water or is it always in the blood? And he went on to say, I can feel the love I want. I can feel the love I need, but it's never gonna come the way I am. Could I change it if I wanted? Could I rise above the flood? Will it wash out in the water or is it always in the blood? Do you feel what John Mayer is struggling with here? Is it just in me? Is it in my body? Is it in my blood? Can I ever get rid of these things? Well, John, if you're listening, I know what you need. You need better blood. You need some blood flowing in your veins that was shed 2,000 years ago. Here's what it says in Hebrews. And so Jesus also suffered outside the city gate to make the people holy through his own blood. You see, we're not able in ourselves. We won't ever be able to rise up and wash it out in the water. And yes, it is in our blood, but Jesus Christ has died to provide better blood. He has died to provide us a new life, not the old life of Adam in rebellion to God, but the new life of the second Adam, risen, living, ruling, and reigning inside us and making us new. It may not wash out in the water, John, but it will wash out in the blood of Christ.